only one that he cannot play at he a can like, play high Ryu. level. <laughs> I want to see that. Uh, no. I mean, yeah. All right, no, but here we go. All right, Panda Bear on Corrin. Let's see. So far, starting off really nice. Kind of staying out of range, not wanting to go super hard on Bayo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what we can expect to see from Razor is, uh, I don't know, I think Razor is a really aggressive Bayo player, and it works out to his advantage most, most of the time. I would say that Razor is that aggressive of a Bayo player. Well, no, you know, who you're, you know who I'm thinking about? I'm thinking about Fade. Yeah, you're thinking about Fade. Yeah. Razor is more of a defensive player. Yeah, for sure. Like, he, he's kind of going for the Salem. Like wait for their wait for your opponent to kind of hang your own noose yeah. kind of player, where fade is more of the mistake rush down type. Yeah, 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 you're right. Oh wow! Oh, the back air clanking with the forward smash. I should not clank. She got like. Oh, that was really nice. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's got conversion drop of that too. He's got those. Jabs and Morn to get a little extra percent. Ooh. Oh, and he's even got instant. <laughs> he's even tries for instant potatoes, but Ledge, he's got those too. Wow. All right, I'm actually liking this Corrin. This is this is looking really clean so far. Yeah, Razor entering right back, getting back onto the center stage. Wow. Oh, you gotta watch your ranges. Razor, why are you gonna taunt? <laughs> it's a fail, man. They all taunt. <laughs> you're right. You're right. Is it it? Crap. I uh, thought maybe up throw. Nah, up throw, I mean, up throw's one of those, on corn, it's one of those kill throws where you think, like, oh my god. Dang! Oh, no, let's go! God damn! <laughs> uh, but anyway, uh, up, yeah, I've, I've been talking to a lot of corn mains, and uh, up throw is like one of those throws that's like hyped up. It's like, oh, doesn't you have a kill throw? Like, nah, it's situational, also, it's dependent on rage. Mm, yeah, you're right. Okay, charging up that dragon shot just a little bit. Trying to get the read on the platform, but Razor not getting it. Get up attack, kind of dislodging it. Yeah, Razor uh, kind of biding his time, trying to find a way in. Well, that forward tilt's gonna wow. be a huge punish. That combo though. That's yeah, funny. I don't know. I didn't even think to, to even do that. Like, that, I, looked, that looked like that looked like Cosmos right there. <laughs> All right. Well, we can see where this corn style is kind of come from. Oh, oh no. This is. Well, he didn't use the jump. He still has a jump. And, Really smart to air dodge because you know Razor wants that edge guard. And it's also scary for Bayo too because if Bayo's just trying to get back to ledge, that uh, hitbox on the up B is massive and has a lot of surprising priority to it. So they, they, Bayo, um, or Razor can definitely get stage spike from uh, Korn's up B. Mm, that's going to get punished. Mm, yeah, you got to. Okay, so it's a pin by ledge. Instant by ledge is good like that, but if you're kind of obvious like that, mm -hmm. they're gonna perfect shield it and just punish you. Well, not even that. On regular shield, you can also punish it, especially with like out of regular shield, you can get a side B afterwards. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Because of how much lag the move has after you land, like you saw it right there, it's very telegraphed about what you're doing as soon as you're pinned into the ledge. Mm. So it's all a matter of guessing where your opponent's going to go. Where kind of very often to go. Uh, Battlefield. I don't disagree with it really. Uh, you can get a lot of combos with uh, what's it called? Corrin's uh, forward airs on the platforms. Wow, that was, nice. that was a really good that small combo there. Right, now starting to space the backer a little bit. Nice, perfect shield leading into wow, some good conversion there. That's that's a good amount of damage. Oh, oh you. Went for it all right there. Maybe it would have worked if he was closer to the ledge. Catching, you know, Bayo rising up and then the hitbox from the yeah. little. Well, so far, this is a really good adaption from Panda. Yeah, this is a really good stage for Parin, like I said. it's You can chase down your opponent really hard, and Panda is showing a great use of this. Yeah, good pivot grab right there. Starting to kind of stay at range. Yeah, Razor. Razor's now like starting to struggle to find a way in. Yeah, Panda's not approaching much at all, really. Doesn't have to. He has a really good lead. Yeah. Oh, ah, uh, didn't get all of it, and that's a platform read. This could be bad for Panda. Oh. Oh, he should have just stayed put. He had the right idea. He did. Oh, that's bad for 
Panda because now Razor is basically right back into it. Down throw, off giving the damage. Yeah, damage and stage control. Ooh, there you go, insta pin by the ledge. Yeah, almost gets the sweet spot. Oh wow, that within. That probably would have killed. Uh, yeah, it, on the on the backswing of it, it would have killed. Nice. Ooh, <laughs> I love. I think, I think Razor forgot about that move. He's like, hey, you got which time? I got a counter, you, bro. You, yeah, you gotta be careful. <laughs> I, it's actually, I, I like from all the uh, Fire Emblem characters, I feel like that counter is the best out of all of them. You think so? Yeah, because it sends you at an angle where it's more like, because it sends you straight up. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Whereas Marth counter kind of sends you up and out. Yeah. Like, that, no, if, since Korn's release, everybody's like, that counter, no, it's it's been, like, really good. Oh, bat within, yeah. getting Razor out of that situation, and Panda Bear is going to be taking 20% off of that jab. Ooh. Tries to instant back on, but Witch Twist is going to get him out of that. Gets a grab, forward throw, but Razor responding right back with a full combo. That is 67%. Panda's now going to watch out. Oh, man. That was good. Oh, man. Razor's catching a lot of uh, Panda Bear's uh, short hops. Yeah, uh, one thing that I notice is anytime that Panda's trying to stay on the platforms, Razor's just now immediately responding with side B. Oh, here we go. That could have been it, to be honest. If he got the sweet spot. Yeah, honestly, the one thing that Panda should definitely work on with this character is if he's going to be in that combo, he needs to work on spacing that side B. Because if you get the tipper of that, man, you are you're, you're gonna golden. You're, that's gonna pay <laughs> dividends. That was a, a lot of good shield pressure from that up smash. Oh, oh the fight! Catching him reading that option onto the platform. Crouching to avoid the bullets. Razor kind of hanging back now. He doesn't really want to commit to anything too hard now because he knows that the wow. opportunity is there. He's starting to get that ledge pressure down. Panda's starting to make it cut work. That's it. Up air, that's going to do it. And a little bit of a pump in victory. A little fist pump. He's starting to feel it. Yeah, I'm glad he, uh, glad he, he didn't give up on corn. Like, I, you know, even though he lost the first match. Oh no, he's staying patient. He's remembering the stuff that you need to do, and now the tools are slowly but surely mm -hmm. starting to come together. So now we go to game three, and town brave counter pick from Razor, because Warren does pretty well on this stage. One, yeah, but so does Bale, man. Those I mean, combos, yeah. like, and uh, Razor has been on point with the combos. Not I mean, killing off the top, uh, but it's still getting racking in a lot of damage. Not doing anything out of the uh, back of it. Falls into a side beat, but good DI to avoid the up tilt. Oh man. Ray's trying to extend all the way. He yeah. lands on the platform. That's a lot of lag right there, and that's basically a free grab or a free punish for whatever Panda wanted to do. Ray. He had, to, he had to think of something fast. He couldn't really optimize it that hard. Tries to jump out of that grab. He might die for this. Yeah, yeah. he's gonna die. That's unfortunate. Got caught in the air. Tried to come down with a neutral air, but the problem with uh, challenging KO in air like that is that Witch Twist just, it's way too good to challenge. Yeah, I, I feel like it beats out almost like every <laughs> Oh my god, no. Oh, no, that's it. Oh, okay, no, he no, had no. his he's jump. He's still fine, he's still I got, fine. I got scared, Panda. Oh. Oh, this oh no. Where are we going? We're going off to the Okay, no, we're we're back. I thought that was gonna be it though, there. That was that was a really good option for Panda. Oh the fight, that was such a brave option and he had the right idea too, but that downwards after burner kick. Just going right past. Really nice good back air from there. These pins are really putting Panda in a really bad spot. Luckily he gets out of there. Rushing down Razor here. Yeah, he's starting to find his spacings and he's starting to get things started, but he just needs to be careful about how often he's throwing out those buttons because Razor is he's catching up. Yeah, he's starting to he's starting to figure things out. Fake to go oh, with the ledge wow, with the no still invincibility. Gets hit by the that was really dangerous. 
Oh wow, I'm surprised that he like didn't die from that. He like got out of it at the last second. Uh, the uh, the beginning hitboxes of that up B aren't really that strong. It's the ending yeah. that's kind of strong. Up throw, see, once again, that up throw, you think that it's one of the go-to options, but it's actually got a surprisingly small amount of knockback. Oh wow, it just runs Ooh. up and up smash? Run up up smash. What? Okay. Okay. As long as he stays patient, Pan has still got this. Forward throw giving Razor back to stage. He's got to watch out by ledge, and he's got to watch out for this yeah. percent because... If I know Razor, when he wants to get the kill, he's going to mix the grabs and the back air. And also, he's got to watch challenging air to air like that because Bayo has so many options to kind of beat Korn out in that air to air exchange. He's just got to space his aerials. Side B. Yep, he's, I knew he was going to go for that grab. Chase down Chase Panda B. so hard. He wants to end this. He's starting to go throw out those dive kicks. One mm. stray of those will hit lead to the end of this game. Oh, wow. Ooh, no. no! Panda should have been dead. No pulling the trigger. Yeah. And that's going to be it. Jab one, two, three into up air. And Razor is going to take it over Panda Bear. Panda kind of giving a little bit of the nod of the head. I mean, it's not a bad showing from Panda. That, no, was, that was, was still really good. Really good. Uh, honestly, it was it was warm up for the corn. The corn is looking crisp. I'm liking it. Mm -hmm, me too. It just there's there's some things that kind of need to come into place before it can be, you know, a bail killer.